in the quaint village of Harmonyville, nestled between rolling hills and blooming meadows, lived a young girl named Leela. She had a heart full of dreams and a mind brimming with curiosity. Leela was known far and wide for her radiant smile and her boundless enthusiasm for life. From a very young age, Leela had a deep passion for music. The village would come alive every evening as she played her violin near the village square. Her melodies weaving tales of joy, love, and hope, the villagers would gather, enchanted by her tunes, and for a moment, their worries would fade away. Leela's parents, however, worried that her passion for music might lead her away from practicality. They wanted her to focus on more traditional skills that could secure her a stable future. Music is wonderful, dear, her father would say. But it won't put food on the table. As Leela grew older, the weight of her parents' concerns pressed upon her. She started to question whether her love for music was a mere folly. She hesitated to practice as often and her once vibrant tunes started to lose their spark. The village, too, felt the absence of her music, and the square that had once been alive with her melodies grew quiet and somber. One day, a traveler arrived in Harmonyville. He was a wise old man with a twinkle in his eye. He heard about Leela's music and sensed that something was amiss. He sought her out and found her sitting by the river her violin untouched in her lap. Why have you stopped playing? Young one, the old man asked gently. Leela sighed. My parents are right. Music might not lead to a secure future. I need to focus on something practical. The old man chuckled softly. My dear, let me tell you a story. Once, in a distant land, there was a garden tended by a passionate gardener. The garden was lush with flowers of every color, and its beauty attracted people from all around. The gardener's heart bloomed with joy as he tended to his garden. Even though some thought he should pursue more, practical, work. One day, a traveler passing through asked him why he spent his days in the garden. The gardener replied, This garden is my passion. It brings me joy. And that joy in turn, brings smiles to those who visit. What could be more practical than spreading joy? Single quote quote. Leela pondered the story, and a glimmer of understanding began to dawn in her eyes. The wise man continued, Leela, pursuing your passion is not just about personal fulfillment. It's about sharing your joy with the world. Your music has the power to uplift spirits, to touch hearts, and to inspire others to follow their own passions. Don't let fear of the future stifle the melodies within you. Leela felt a renewed sense of purpose. With the traveler's words ringing in her ears, she picked up her violin and played. The melodies flowed effortlessly, resonating with the whispers of the wind and the gentle gurgle of the river. Villagers who had missed her music gathered around drawn by the magnetic pull of her art. As Leela played, something magical happened. Her music seemed to breathe life into the village itself. The flowers bloomed brighter, the sky seemed bluer, and a sense of harmony settled over Harmonyville once more. It was as if the village itself had recognized the importance of pursuing one's passion. Over time, Leela's music spread beyond Harmonyville. People from neighboring villages came to listen. And her melodies began to travel far and wide. Her passion had not only brought her immense joy but had also touched the lives of countless others. Filling their hearts with hope and inspiration. And so, remember the story of Leela and the wisdom of the old traveler. Pursue hobbies and passions that bring you joy. For they have the power to transform not only your life but the lives of those around you. Just like Leela's music turned Harmonyville into a place of enchantment. Your passion can weave magic into the fabric of the world.